My name is Eli Mays, I'm class of 2021 in Knoxville, Tennessee. I was just recently named the top 10 golfers in the area for high school 2021 season. Yeah, I hope you'll enjoy this video. Eli, what's your most favorite shot to uh, hit? The shot I'm most comfortable with would be the left to right draw. I've really worked on that over the years and that's kind of my natural swing path. And so it's easy whenever I need to go to that, I like to go to that and it works well for me. Perfect. Eli, what do you think is the biggest change in your driver uh, over the last year? Uh, I just worked on timing and rotating the hips. I kind of, I always struggle with the timing, getting it correct and stuff. And this year I was able to grind in the off season and get that right. And I've seen a big jump in accuracy and distance both at the same time. Yeah. How many yards do you think you've gained over this last year since? A good, I've gained a good 40 yards with it. Just yeah. been working all off season, just kind of figuring it out and it's had it's paid off for me. This yeah. Season. After, okay. Eli, that was dead straight. Do you think that you can accurately bend it both ways? Yeah, it's something I've, through my career, I've been able to play both types of shots and for certain tournaments, I've played both types of shots all the time. Uh, I've had no problem with and I've been able to maneuver around it and pull the shots I need when I need them. Eli, being a member here at Holston Hills has its advantages and that's that the um, practice short game area is phenomenal. How long do you think you spend most of your practice time in and around this short game area and the other one that they've got here? A uh, good guess for me would be about 65-70% with these facilities that they have out here. It's significantly better than anywhere else. you got to take advantage of that. So. Just through the years I've been trying to do that and work on it, it's paid off easily. The biggest part of my game is my short game, and you'll see that on the course if you're ever with me, and then stuff like that, I just take advantage of it. And that's obviously where the strokes are gained in the round, and I've realized that through the years, and I've just kind of come to terms with it, and I've worked on it as hard as I can, and thankfully out here, it's as good as it can get, so I take advantage of it. Eli, you've always had a really good sense of distance and feel in your putting. What are some of the aspects that you think about? Uh, so with me, it's just finding that line. Kind of, I always look to the zero line and then look up from that and kind of count my steps off to realize how high up I need to play it on that. And then from there, it's just all speed. Once you can read that zero line, then it's kind of given to you and you know exactly where it's going to go. And then it's all speed from there. So I, know, I just memorize that speed, get it down pat, and then I know I'm set for the round to go. Perfect. Perfect. 